Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do an update for my Project Pan collab and this is the Project Pan Project McFly, sorry, that I'm doing with Amanda here on YouTube and I have just been loving doing this collab with her. I know the update was supposed to do Tuesday but because I had an exam Tuesday and Wednesday um, I just couldn't do it in my head so I didn't have time so now I'm done with that exam and I have some spare time right now that I can do it in so here we go. We have chosen three categories because we are basing this on um, Back to the Future movies. So we have the 1950s, 1980s and the future. So for each category we have two products and I'm going to show you the products from 1950s first. In there I have a red lipstick that I have on right now and I have a black eyeliner. That is just screaming 1950s to me because of the red lips and winged eyeliner and stuff like that. Firstly I'm going to show you my Earthflame lipstick in 26 and this is getting so small. I have used this so much. I don't think I have used red lipstick this often <laughs> this year. So I actually have a lot of progress and I will show you in a picture here because I'm not going to bother with the notebook and stuff. But I have so much progress and I'm so excited. Um, if this is going to be done by the finale next month, I'm not sure, but I will do my best and yeah. I will have a ton of use this year of this lipstick because I started all the way up here and now I'm like here or something. So I have a lot of progress this year, so I'm very, very happy about that. And the next thing is my L'Oreal Pot Eyeliner, L'Oreal Gel Intense Eyeliner in 01 Pure Black. And I don't know if I had pan last time, some of you said you can see the speck of pan in the bottom, but I have now used so much of it that I have hit pan. I used this for a few Halloween looks, I don't know if it was last time, yeah, since last time I did some Halloween looks that helped me to hit pan and use it, but I haven't used it since, I don't believe. Um, just I was getting bored so I didn't want to use it basically but I have hit pan and I'm so happy about that then we have the 1980s and I have my benefit erase paste because it's purple and the 1980s is very disco and colorful so I thought this was perfect and I have hit pan since you saw it last time. I have hit major pan actually and I'm very very excited about it because I didn't think I had that little left so I can definitely use it up next year. My goal was to hit pan and the same as the eyeliner just to hit pan and get some use out of it because I know they were hard products to work on but they just seemed perfect for this project to work on so just progress you know but i'm so happy about this this is taking me so long just to hit pan and get some use out of it second product is a highlighter from this palette and it is the Disco Disco Solid Gold highlighter from my The Balm, Balm Jovi Rockstar Palette and of course Disco Disco is 1980 themed so I thought that was perfect. I have a hole in it but that was just because I wanted to poke a hole and see how much I have left and I have a lot. <laughs> so I'm not sure if I can hit pan on this by the finale next month. But I do have a good dip in it and I use it every single day so I'm loving it. And yeah, that's just the progress for that one. Then for the future category I have my Benefit What's Up highlighter and I will show you the progress here besides me. I have a bit more than last time because I was I leaned it sideways can you say that sideways to use it that way so it didn't go down but you can see here on the sides it's not straight anymore um, so I 
try to do it more awkward I think but yeah I have used a ton here so it's kind of slanted I have used it a ton maybe I can use it up by the finale maybe not um, but I do think I can use it up by the new year so that would be so exciting to finish a cream highlighter actually the last product I have is my P2 the future is mine eyeshadow and this is in virtually bronze I have some use out of it right here I have not hit pan I will not hit pan but I have used it a ton so I'm pretty happy about it but yeah I have been very excited to be working on this That is everything for my products. I hope you enjoyed, even though there wasn't that much progress, but at the same time there was. I hope you will check out Amanda. She will be linked down below as always. She is amazing and she is a very, very, very good painter. So you will enjoy her channel if you enjoy mine. And yeah, then I hope you will stick around on my channel. I have a lot of videos planned out for you guys and big ambitions for next year's Penning year. And yeah, I hope you will stick around and then I will see you in next time. Bye guys! Mm -hmm.